Rejection is the obliteration of hope, but at the same time, rejection could be the pathway to peace. Think. What was rejected? Me? No, not really, I'm still here. That's too personal. I was wondering if there was any chance of getting a, uh, a free pizza in return for uh, making some free advertisement for your Pizza Hut. Uh, no. Rejection is the destroyer of your desires and dreams of the future, but also frees you from the delusion of you needing anything more than what is right here in front of you, right now. Well, was that something, oh, well, you, would that be something you're personally interested in, or? Uh, no, sorry. Oh. The stars don't feel rejected by the earth when their view is blocked by the cloud. The moon doesn't fight for attention after only being visited a couple of times. You wouldn't feel rejected from life if you had never lived. How can we help you? Uh, is there a pizza restaurant in here? No! No? What is, is simply what had to be. Would it be possible if I could get a free pizza but in return for your business, I'll make you a free advert. Oh, oh even with the filming. Everything happens anyway. Rejection is the reintegration with the simplest and most grounded reality. A sign to stop chasing what can never be caught. For an explosion would happen if it was ever in your grasp. An explosion that would kill all. Hi, dear. Hey, sorry, you guys don't sell pizza, do you? Next to the door. I am me. I am not a quantifiable worth, so much so that I don't even need to feel worthy. To be, and then additionally, to be here is surely more than enough. Uh, free pizza, if I made a free advertisement video for your what company. Size? What size? Just medium. Medium? Yeah, yeah. Eating pork. Something is everything after rejection clears the clouds. Be careful what you wish for as it might make you forget what was. Yeah, yeah, so that, I got rejected with that idea. So that's all good, for sure. Thank you, thank you. Just, just they, they, food they, they didn't give me free food either, man. I tried to get free food myself, I'm sorry. I now start to think, why the hell did you think of this idea? Well, I guess it's, um, it's less about the pizza and more about the idea that making a video is just about getting rejected a lot. But overcoming that is the only way to reconcile with actually making a fucking video in the first place. Hello? Hi there. Um, a bit of a random request. I'm wondering... Hey, hey I'm wondering, uh, do you guys repair mugs? We're closed. Oh. oh. Oh, um, well, could I ask about a future, uh, maybe coming in tomorrow? I'm not interested about reconciling with the world. I think it's more important to talk about how to reconcile with oneself. If rejection was the chaos, then reconciliation is the pursuit of order. But if something has been broken, it will never be the same again. If anything, what exists afterwards will merely reflect the pieces of what once were. And often the thing that we're trying to fix is so hard to actually fix that we delude ourselves with what we're fixing. We create a different problem to solve. We can never really be transparent with ourselves, so we forget the process of how such a puzzle came to be. But reject the puzzle. Reject the illusion. Reconciliation only comes with fixing what truly needs to be fixed. Hello, your call cannot be taken at this moment, so please leave your message after the tone. Hi there, uh, I'm inquiring about if you guys fix mugs. All the best. Okay, uh, let's do... Do you have any vegetarian stuff? Yeah, yeah we have vegetarian pizza. Is this one vegetarian? This one, the mushroom. Yeah, you, you can you can call it a vegetarian, but uh, you know, do you have vegetable sauce? Yeah. Yeah, we can make it. It's a white white sauce, white based pizza. Like the yeah, pizza is white. Pizza pizza. Pizza. It's an interesting pizza, to be honest. And it's not comes with like uh, regular tomato sauce. It's just white sauce. We make it with the vegetable sauce. Double cream. It's a. Oh, like, I see. Okay, let's do it. You know, <laughs>
Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, that's, that's all good. I mean, let's do that. Hey there. Um, I wanted to inquire about, um, I'm trying to sell a mug, and I was wondering if that's, um, the sort of product you guys would buy. Well, we can't have the brand, so what is the brand of the mug? Um, well, that's the thing. I think it could be of some value, but I, I don't necessarily know how to value it, you know? Um, okay, I see. Well, I mean, it is fashion items that we sell primarily, uh, but we would, you know, make an exception for ceramics from, you know, Hermes, uh, Versace, that sort of thing. So, is it from a, a fashion brand or is it a, you know, ceramics maker? Um, we're looking at sort of more, yeah, like, historical antique piece. Okay, in that case I don't believe it's something we'd be able to sell on our platform. I see, okay. Wait. I got free pizza. That means our second cousin has its first ever sponsor. Partnership will use for satire. The video isn't gonna be that good that I should get it for free. I swear, I swear. I've been I've been rejected so many times today. I would love to pay for this pizza as a thank you for. However, if what you've reconciled with no longer serves its positive purpose, then just know it's only right to move on and let it go. Reconciliation is a means to an end, but not an ending in itself. Because if you hold on for what is broken for too long, then it will only come back to hurt you. For what was rejected will always be part of who we are, whether we like it or not. Rejection and reconciliation are all happening all at once. It's mug. <laughs> Say, we often want things without any real meaning. Reconcile with what you want, and then you will never, ever feel rejected. Okay.